All right, how's everybody doing? Good. Thank you. Thank you very much for coming out tonight. Thank you. I'm sorry about the weather delay. Um, all proceeds, we'll make sure we send it to the meteorologist school and they can um, get on top of that. But thank you for your patience. We really appreciate it. They've been working really, really hard. Um, half the group moved in last Tuesday. Another half Wednesday. Um, I will say, and I have no problem saying that we've had only less than two hours of field time almost every single day. So we're working on that. We're working on that, but we have not been out here a lot. And the lights go out right as pet. No joke. So we're going to make sure that we get out of here even with the delay on time. Um, one of the tunes in our show that comes much later, but we don't know a drill for it yet, is When You Wish Upon a Star. Um, the name of the show is Upon a Star, so we're going to uh, play. It's just over a minute long. We'll just do that real quickly. We've been, we've been learning. You'll see music stands out here as well because we don't have it memorized yet. Um, oh, by the way, if you don't know who I am, I'm Jason DeGroff. I'm <laughs> number 13 year for me here at UNH. So please enjoy when you wish upon a star. Welcome one of our three drum makers, Annika, to the podium. sharing them with us. We have one of our um, biggest classes that came in this year uh, with almost 100 incoming freshman students and a couple transfers as well, which is really nice. So very excited to get back up to kind of where we were uh, pre-COVID and things like that. Love performing for an audience. I'm glad most of the staff is up here. So since this is the percussion feature, uh, we have over here with Peter Swan. Welcome, Peter. Where are you, Tom? We have a couple Toms. And we're very fortunate to have, um, in my opinion, and it's shared by many of the, the world's, <laughs> world's most, foremost percussion writer in the marching arts. Very, very happy to call him a friend. He was the associate director for me um, through college at UMass Amherst. Was an associate director there for 43 years. Um, really, really. Color guard! 
Slow down. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll, I'll get on with it, but we're very, very fortunate to have him here writing the entire battery book. Not only that, coming down to band camp and teaching as well. So the students are incredibly lucky. I'm really lucky because he's been such a mentor and a great friend to me and just sets me on the right path when I'm starting to veer a little bit. So it's great um, to have all that knowledge and experience. Please welcome Tom Hannum.
building, so we're very, very thankful that he has not only his percussion talents, but the carpentry stuff works out well for us, too. So we're very, very pleased. Uh, AJ Rittenhouse not here. He's at another rehearsal tonight. Um, but AJ was also a five-year member of the band and also worked for the university like Kyle does. So we're very, very fortunate to have them um, with us. We've had people in and out throughout camp. We have a wonderful new color guard staff. I'm so excited to have them and see what they bring to the table. Um, we have two new writers, Caption Heads, Caitlin Hyde, Tyler DeGro over there. And then uh, back for her third year and more, um, my daughter Elena DeGroff. And then Monica has been with us, I think, like 10 years now, maybe? Wow. Almost as long as me. So wonderful with the twirlers and every time I start thanking people I'm sure I'll forget so I'll remember some more as we go. I'd also like to thank Mr. Carney down there taking pictures for like the last, uh, it seems like forever. Thank you some amazing pictures. I know we have a couple other parents that are interested in taking some photos and getting it on the Facebook uh, photo page. There's a there's a marching band photos page. There's also a band parent page. If you're not on it, please request to be on it. All we ask is that you tell us who your child or grandchild is so we get you on there because I get this one to be a hot thing that people want to be on it, but um, try to try to give us that information at least if you can. Um, let's see. So that's a little bit of our show. We learned some drill this week. We're very very excited about. Can everybody on the field get some water, please? And then we'll set up the top of the show. Sydney and Colby are both seniors. Annika's a junior. Um, for the 
the second year in a row we've actually had all rookie drum majors, which uh, when I say rookie, I mean first year drum majors, but they're not rookies to the band, so, um, but they're doing an amazing job. All right. Angry fan, sorry. All right. Let's reset the letter C, and we'll go C to J all in. In addition to our wonderful drum majors, we have a lot of student leadership. We could not do it without them. I'm a, I'd like our four horn sergeants to raise their hand, please. All right, we also have, um, let me get all our brass section leaders to jump up and down.
of them for coming out. Let's thank all the audience for coming out today.